Hi there, I'm Richard Klee, and I'm here to tell you about an exciting and important new project here at Beecher Community Schools. We are on a mission to renovate, remodel, and reopen the old Beecher High School. It's about time. As you may know, Beecher students in grades six through 12 are currently in the same building. Beecher High School, once a sprawling campus with multiple buildings, was closed in 2013 due to declining enrollment. This was brought on by the closure of General Motors plants and the lack of funding for building upkeep. But we think it's about time to reopen the school that was for so many years the heart of the community. Beecher High School students benefit from a wide range of course options for 21st century learning. They participate in a dual enrollment program that gives them college credit and a head start on their future. They participate in a fantastic variety of arts, leadership, athletics, and other club activities. The Beecher Bucks are the pride of our community with one of the state's winning us basketball programs. The Beecher boys have claimed nine state championships. Our kids deserve a high school they can be proud of. We're off to a great start. Our district made the local news last summer when businessman Matt Rizek of Detroit Rocket Mortgage was inspired by the Beecher story and helped secure $600,000 in funding for four beautiful state-of-the-art locker rooms a new gym floor, and other athletic amenities. We are so grateful for this gift and the momentum it has created. But there's much more work to be done before we can reopen the building. Today, we are seeking philanthropic partnerships to help give our students the high school learning environment they deserve and to help strengthen our community. Strong schools are an essential part of any community and the key to attracting businesses and families who want to put down roots and grow into the future. Let's grow together. Check out our website if you'd like to be part of that future. Let's talk. It's always a great day at Beecher.